Diluc of Monster. Not interested in idle chit chat. If you have things you want to get done, let me know. Guess we can rest a bit. You should really bring the Knights of Favonius with you next time. I still have a lot to do at the guild. How about you take a rest while I go back? Mondstadt has so many windmills, doesn't it? Well, the city is built above water. So it probably relies on the windmills to draw the water upwards. That's correct! The winds blow through Mondstadt all year, so this supply of water is very stable. Also, the windmills are what they call visible winds. And wind chimes are called the audible winds. Paimon guesses they can be thought of as mascots and prayers to the animal Archon for protection. Ah, mascots. So, like you then, Paimon. No, not at all! They're made of wood, and you can't eat them in an emergency either! Cause all you'll do is grind your teeth down! Uh... I don't know what to say to that. <sighs> work hardly works here in Mondstadt. Why do you say that? Just look at Huffman from the Knights of Favonius. He does his best at his duties every day. But the ever-relaxed Captain Kaya is his boss. Hmm, but isn't Jean who works the hardest the acting Grand Master? Well, how about this then? Venti's the god of Mondstadt, and he's the laziest of them all! Everyone says that Mondstadt is the land of the wind. <sighs> but I wonder which direction the seasonal winds come from. Why don't we ask Venti? He'll probably just dodge the question with a <laughs> or something. True. The animal Archon is just a tone-deaf bard. What does he know about the wind? So here in Mondstadt, alchemy is practiced out on the streets? Is that so strange? In many of the worlds I've been to in the past, alchemy has always been a secretive art. Watching alchemy being practiced as a part of daily life is like being in a world where people have three stomachs. Hyman thinks only having one stomach is weird. Uh... Are you serious? What do you think? Oh? Do you know how to read the stars, too? That's amazing! Not a lot of people outside Sumeru can do it. Pilot's curious. Come on, do a reading for me, quick! Hmm... The movement of these stars... tells me that... in, say, seven days from now... <gasps> in seven days what? Something good... or something bad might occur. <laughs> right. Your theory sounds as rock solid as a geo slime, and about as brainy, too. On the way back to Mondstadt after rescuing <sighs> Devala, we finally got to see one of the seven Archons, didn't we? It was interesting to see what kind of god he was. Hmm. Haven't we known Venti for quite a while now? As Venti, yes. But still. This was the first time that we got to see him as the animal Archon Barbados. People say that when Barbados made this land, he used the storm to flatten the cliffs and valleys. Still, it looks like he missed a few spots. Like Star Snatch Cliff? Exactly. On the map, it almost looks as if it was meant to be the apex of a vertical structure, but ended up at the wrong orientation. W what's an apex? Paimon's heard that couplets are a traditional art form in Liyue. If you can write a line that works as a second half to one that someone else has written, you'll be well paid. But linking the couplet is hard.